all right um right now what we want to do now is that, is that um, we want to actually you know he, he, he start setting up our environment of our web development so what we'll do here is that um um we create a folder I'll call it edu consult and by the time you do that you um sorry let me just let me do it like this edu consult um i think i've done something like that before so i just want to give you a recap of what i did so i do consult so by the time you do that definitely you have an empty folder so just double click on all these places and um you know your wordpress you need to do something with your wordpress you need to do something with your wordpress and what you need to do is that um you need to extract it you need to extract it so by the time you extract it finished you uh you, you can see how extract it i just click on extract file extract air so you double click on this wordpress and you copy the code inside so by the time you copy the code inside you go back um when you go back you go and paste it inside this edu consult you know it's an empty folder so inside this edu consult um by the time you paste the code inside it there's a particular folder you need to go and locate so that folder is when you are going to drop your team and at the same time you are going to drop your plugins so let me show you something quick quickly so double click on this you have elementor is a plugin potion extra is also a plugin w ocean wp is a team so two of these we need to actually take it to the plugin folder inside what we're actually copying by the time this thing finish copying you will not understand what i'm actually talking about don't forget you need to install your exam if you actually want to make stuff to work all right so right now what we want to do is that um right now we have copied finished all right what we want to do right now is that you go to your do consult so you come to your wordpress content wp content you see you have team and plugins so in that these plugins you just paste the two there so by the time you paste the two there um you can see it is in a zip file you need to extract it for me like i said let me just take it one after the other you can extract file here you take this one to extract a extract it so once you're through with that don't forget all the one that is zipped you delete it so there are some things you will be noticing you might not see some kind of display like this like this particular icon on your computer you need to download what is called WinRAR. so this is WinRAR. so you need to go and download WinRAR. WinRAR is what you normally use to ex unzip a zipped folder because all the stuff that you download has been zipped so you need to unzip this so that's what i just did right now okay so right now that i've successfully done that what you do now is that you go straight to um webkit and pick ocean wp which is a team like i said team is what gives you the look and feel of your world of your website so you come back to team for me and you paste it there so by the time you paste it there you do the same thing for it as well right click and um extract um extract uh, extract uh, okay so right now so you've successfully extracted it okay so um sorry we need to delete this zip file as well so by the time you've done that definitely that means you've set up your folder for work okay so you just have to copy this like i said i repeat you need to what um install your team i mean you need to install the exam so you come back to your local computer if you are not seeing your local computer this is how to actually locate it um you click on this place and you set for example and you scroll down to where you can see HA doc and uh, you paste that into console there you can see i've successfully pasted it there so once you've done that the next thing we need to do is just now to create database for our project you know you know a website cannot survive without database you, you need to set up a database for your website okay uh, because we want to make this particular website dynamic so how are we going to do that um make sure you on your what example so if you are not seeing the example this is how to actually locate it you come straight down to each example which is from your local computer like the how i actually entered this place the other time so you double click on it click on example and scroll down to where you can see con exam control so when you double click it it's going to actually show you this particular what box so all you need to do is just to click from start to stop 
starts to stop it's going to show you this green icon this gray color so once it show you the green color that means you are good to go you are set to move on all right so then then the, that is when you cannot type local host you can see by the time you type local just look on it there. whether you are connected to the internet or not it's going to show you this display so don't be panic so what i'll do is that i'll click on this php my admin why are you seeing this php my admin you are seeing this php my admin because wordpress is being built with php framework so that is why so it is php code that is in that wordpress we're talking about so we click on this new um like i said when you click on the new um you now type um <coughs> excuse me um edu consult db so edu consult db i have to copy this because i definitely need it so i'm copying it right away and i'll click on create so once i've done that the next thing i'll do is go to the next tab and click a new tab type localhost and then don't forget what is the name of our folder it's called edu consult all right edu consult so by the time thus ensure that this edu consult is the same with your fo project folder name if you're having difference between this name you might likely not to see the next thing you're about to see right now so okay so it's loading and it's trying to figure out whether the edu consult name is the same thing as the file project folder name that i dropped in my exam so um we're still waiting it's the same thing you know, now that it's the same thing it's going to ask me to you know continue with some configuration so i want it to be english so united states i click on continue so and it's good to actually ask me what to do so don't worry you can take your time to pause the video and read it but i don't have, we don't have the time now because of our um, time of recording so let's just click on next go so this database name that i copy is what i'm actually going to paste which is edu console db so the, the root is always um the, at default the username is always at default call root so the password is empty don't put any password there so i leave every other thing like the way it is so click on submit it's going to take you to another section that you should install the wordpress so this is when we will be able to install our wordpress okay kindly click on run the installation and let's see what's going to happen all right so right now the site title is going to be edu consult like i said edu consult and the username is going to be admin and the password is going to be one two three four five six seven eight nine dot okay and um the email is going to be fashion bees and and um i'll click on install right now it's telling me that um the password is too weak so i think i have to say um this is who i am with um an exclamation mark okay all right so i click on install wordpress Okay, so this WordPress is now installing, so it has installed, finished. So click on save. All right, so right now that we've done that, what we need to do right now is that uh, we need to log in. So if you want to log in, it's going to ask us admin, and uh, this is who I am with the exclamation mark. So just click on login. Okay. All right, we have successfully logged in. So right now, let's go and verify whether we have installed our team or not. Um, let's go to appearance and click on teams. And uh, we can see our team is there. So, and um, our plugin is going to be there as well. So this is where we're actually going to stop for now. But let's check it out. All our plugins have been installed. Let's check where are we going to find plugin there. Um, okay, this is the plugin, install plugin. Let's go and check it out whether we will see ocean w ocean extra and um elemental so it's loading let's take let's be patient all right so okay okay you can see ocean extra is there elemental is there so in the next session we're going to activate all our teams and all our plugins and we're going to dive in in so work all right guys hope you actually enjoy this and um i'm so much enjoying this as well have a good day. Great ready for the next one.